What is to be sung transpired in days of yore, when the Divine Archon still walked the Earth? A dragon cast his curious gaze on the world below, as he parted from the heavens that gave his birth. The dragon sought truth amongst common folk, but mortal trifles only fogged his mind. The wind-born bard strummed his strings dolce, and the holy lyre answered his questions kind. The dragon was but a child full of wonder, and soared the heavens free from care. The bard's songs invited him to sing along, for he yearned to let all perceive him fair. Enchanting legends the bard and dragon were, but the tides of despair soon engulfed the land. The Lion Fang perished, and the Falcon Flag slept, as a vile dragon approached Mondstadt in Lone Stand. Over the cathedral loomed death and his friends. Of the people's agony, the bards soon sang. The soaring dragon heeded his grave calls, and amidst the windstorms a brutal war sprang. Blood of venom sent the sky dragon into slumber, only to awake to be expelled in abhor. Why do people in this age loathe me so? But the holy liar replied no more. Wrath and woe, vigor and venom, poured from the dragon's bitter eyes. The dragon's curse sprawled in silence, but the liar could no longer soothe his cries. Wait, you guys are... Oh, that's right. You're the ones that scared Dvalin away. Dvalin? Who's that? Huh? Oh, right! Most people seem to call him Storm Terror. Why do you call him that? Are you two meant to be close or something? Oh, so close. Hey, so... Paimon thinks this guy has a screw loose. I'm Venti the Bard. Three-time winner of the most popular bard of Mondstadt, to be precise. So... What do you need from me? Given you recognize us, Paimon doesn't believe we need to explain any further. Of course it's about Storm Terror! Storm? Hey! Cut it with the Amnesia Act! Alright, show it to him. Oh! Isn't this... What? The crystal has been purified! When? Tavalin, he... The anguish he feels has brought him to tears. Tears? He was once such a gentle child, now so full of rage and suffering. I also came across a teardrop crystal. Can you purify it? do have some wonderful abilities. Someone like you is going to end up getting written into a bard's poem. Oh, a hero so bright, should she stand in the light. Though stand in the shade, and you'll be met by a blade. Alas, I've really not the time to compose a melody for you at this moment. Anyway, even if Dvalin is not taken down, his life will still wither away in the breeze. He'll burn himself out in the flames of anger. I really must thank you for purifying the teardrop crystal. It has helped me greatly. But I've already come to devise my own plan. Oh? And what plan would that be? Seeing this tear has brought to mind a friend so dear. 
friend. <laughs> One must be going. Hey, where are you running off to? To the symbol of Mondstadt's hero. Bye bye. Huh. What do you make of that? As far as he's concerned, you're a weirdo too, you know. Know what? Familiar? I don't know. Oh? What are you doing here? Though I was just wondering if you would happen to follow me. You speak of the god of Animo, Barbados? He already disappeared from Mondstadt a long time ago. Liyue and Inazuma's respective gods of Geo and Electro are still present, but Mondstadt has seen many a moon since they last saw their own god. Why do you wish to know about the god of Animo? Does it have something to do with Devalin? It's because gods... Um... Just how is it that everyone sees Storm Terror? I'm quite curious. That said, there's no need to rush. I have not been back in a while. It seems there are a few who are unhappy with my arrival. The wind! I can't open my eyes! What is a creature like that doing out here in such a cold place? You think it was going after that green guy? His relationship with the wind seems even deeper than yours. <laughs> Let's spark things up a little. Don't don't be such a brute. The dragon wasn't the only thing affected by this change in the wind. 
Now then, you were saying someone had told you about the dragon? Is that so? Quite the scholar, I must say that, Lisa. She's not wrong. The conflict has reached this point only because both sides have resorted to the use of force. His hate, however, did not arise from the people not making tribute to the Four Winds. Nor was it born from his own nature, but instead came about as a product of his degradation. Degradation? The black blood flowing through his heart has been torturing him for years. That's what has allowed him to be led astray by the lies of the Abyss Mage. Correct. They are from the Abyss Order, an organization comprised of non-human beings. They despise mankind. I don't know where they come from. All I know is that they hold deep hatred toward the human world. Many hilly trolls out in the wild take orders from them and act as their weapons. Before arriving here, I too was like Dvalin, cursed and left to waste. But now, before us stands the symbol of Mondstadt's hero, the place from which Mondstadt rose. The wind amongst the branches is good. I love the way it smells. Being here with you beneath this great tree feels like when the tear was purified earlier. Like the poison is leaving my body. Mm, feels much better. So, how exactly did you get poisoned? Uh, that would be because I tried to communicate with Dvalin earlier, but was... interrupted. As a result, not only did I not manage to help Dvalin break his curse, but instead was also infected myself. Yes, it was you! So to make up for it, you're coming with me to the cathedral. The Mondstadt Cathedral? To do what exactly? To claim a certain holy liar de Himmel. One of the most treasured items in Mondstadt. It's the lyre that Barbados used to play. With it, perhaps I can help Dvalin draw his gentle nature back out of this nightmare he's going through. Will it really stop Storm Terror from causing more damage? Of course! I'm the best bard in the world. There's not a single song I do not know, no matter if it's from the past, present, or future. Look me in the eyes. Do you not find me trustworthy? So how can we get the Holy Liar? It's said that it's enshrined deep within the cathedral, somewhere safe. I'll go take a look around. You can come if you want.
me handle this. Hello there, sister! May the Animo God bless you, young bard. How can I help you? Actually, I know a secret that can save Mondstadt from its current predicament. Oh, what a blessing from the God of Animo! But you should report that to the Knights of Favonius. Why have you come to me? <laughs> because you, dear sister, are able to help! I'd like to borrow the Holy Liar. With it, I'll be able to help Storm Terror. Please see yourselves out. What? It's a vicious dragon indeed, but once the acting Grandmaster makes up her mind, nothing can stand in the Knight's way. That's simply not acceptable! Wouldn't Storm Terror end up getting killed that way? That foolish beast betrayed the winds. Not even the god of Animo themselves would forgive it. Please, I beg of you! I'm afraid not, little bard. Strange. Somehow I feel so bad rejecting this sweet child. Then... I guess I'm left with no other choice. I cannot hide anymore! My disciples, rejoice! Behold, the god of Animo, Barbados, has descended! Shocked, aren't you? Don't you just want to cry out and rejoice? How does it feel to finally meet the god you've been serving? If there's nothing else, I'll be going back to handle the cathedral's paperwork now. Oh, wait! Huh? She didn't even bat an eyelid. But I have at least learned what I wanted to know. She didn't deny that the cathedral is enshrining the Holy Liar. Now, since you're the hotshot of the Knights of Favonius, maybe you can give it a shot. What should I give? Barbados bless you. I know you. You and Amber saved Mondstadt that day. So what brings you here? Tasks from the acting Grand Map? Is that so? Not that I don't trust you. It's just that a suspicious bard came looking to borrow the Holy Liar as well. He's full of nonsense and even called himself Barbados. He must be up to something. There are regulations in place for the use of the Holy Liar. Currently, it's only used in Ludihar Pastum. Signed documents from the Grand Master, Seneschal, and Community Representative are all required. So, may I see the document from the Knights of Favonius? A signed document is required. Without it, there's not much I can do. Now, if you'll excuse me, I really am quite busy as of late. didn't work. I knew it. <laughs> you knew it? I just wanted to know how influential the hotshot of the Knights of Favonius is. You see, the best warrior should always be presented with the best sword. And yet here we are. Does the story not make for a fitting ballad? So what are you trying to say? That we're not good enough? No, that's not it. More of a commentary regarding Mondstadt's inability to see the warrior standing right before its very eyes. Very well. Looks like borrowing it is not going to be possible. We're simply going to have to steal it. Today we stand for free will! Any suggestions on just how we steal it? Come now, speak up! That's what free will is for. <laughs> Look at you, sidetracked from the start. But seriously, you're more suitable for the job than I. Aside from singing, I don't really have any other talents. Besides, if I was caught, I'd have no one to write the grave injustice of my arrest. How can it be a grave injustice if you got caught stealing red-handed? But things are different for you. You are the superstar of the Knights of Favonius. You have made contributions to Mondstadt. Should you get caught, you would easily be able to talk your way out of it. The guards here, it seems they're off duty throughout the night. If we manage to seize this opportunity, it should be smooth sailing from here. Stop mentioning us getting caught! What do you say? 
Ah, uh, yes. Seems I did mention that. Your point being? Why does your decision hinge upon whether or not I am a god? Paimon will fill you in on her background story when we get the time. Huh? Don't be shy.
are you doing oh, here? No, run! Oh no! We're busted! Run! What? Follow me. Master D. Luke, this is this week's accounts. <sighs> the disaster has greatly affected business. Well, let's hope it all ends soon. Hi! We'd like a seat at your, uh, least conspicuous table. Um, the second floor has fewer customers. You'd be less conspicuous up there. But aren't you a bard? Why not sit front and center? <laughs> Let's save the paid performance for next time. We'll be heading up now. See you in a bit. Hey, keep an eye on them. There's something strange about that bard. I'll go ask around. Ask who, exactly? The protectors of Mondstadt. What would you like? 